Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop tutorial. I'm going to show you how to add highlights to any image in seconds. I'm going to show you how to do it using blurs and screen modes, and it's going to take one or two minutes. We're going to go really, really quick. Let's start from scratch. I'm going to delete all this. Here we go. So we've loaded up our image. The first step, very quickly, go to the left side here on your toolbar. Grab your quick selection tool. You don't have to, just grab any selection tool, but I like to select the quick selection tool because we'll use it later. And then at the top, you'll see select subject and you're going to see a down arrow. Click on the down arrow and make sure there's a check mark beside cloud. Once you do that, it's ready to go. Click on select subject. And this is going to use the Adobe Cloud servers to go ahead and make a selection. It has done a very good job selecting this pupperoo. However, it got part of the leash. So to remove something from the selection or from this, I just hold down the alt key on a, on a PC, option key on a Mac and it removes it. If you need to add something, just go ahead and start clicking on it and it will add it. So Alt key to remove, just regular left click to add. Okay, so we've got a pretty good selection of our pupper. The next step is I'm gonna hold down the Command key on a Mac, Control key on a PC and press the letter J. When I do that, this is creating a layer via copy. Basically what I've done is I've created a second layer of that dog, but only the dog. And you can tell because when I turn the bottom layer off, the dog's still there. So we've got a second layer of the doggo. All right, good stuff. Now let's get cracking. We're gonna go up here to the top. I'm gonna go to filter, I'm gonna go to blur, and I'm gonna go to Gaussian blur. And when you do that, you add a blur. And if you've looked at highlights, they're often not you know, super in focus. There's a little bit of a shiny, halo-ish, glisteny blur to it. So here we go. I'm adding a blur. In this case, I'm gonna go with 20.4 pixels, but you can go on whatever works for you. I'm gonna go with this for now, and then I'm gonna click on OK. So we've got our top doggy. <laughs> our top doggy is blurred out, but we're not where we need to be yet. The next step, and it's very critical, is we're gonna change the blending mode of the top. I'm gonna go from normal, and watch this. I'm gonna add it into screen, and as soon as you do that, look at that. A halo has come around our doggy, and uh, the heavens have opened up, the light source is on them, and look at that. Here's the original dog. Here's the new dog. Now there's a chance that this is exactly what you want and you don't need to go any further. That said, if you wanna maybe put the highlights on the edge of the fur, for example, maybe around here, and then leave the rest of the body with some shadows on it, let me show you how to do that next. All right, so to go ahead and just sort of brush in the, the highlights and the shadows, I'm gonna hold down the Option key on a Mac, the Alt key on a PC, and I'm going to click on this mask button here, or Add Layer Mask. When I do that, if you have the option or the alt key pressed down, it's going to add a black layer mask. It's going to negate all the work we've done so far. Not to worry, we're now gonna start painting. Making sure you're selected on the black mask. I'm gonna to go to the left side here into my toolbar. I'm gonna to grab my brush tool. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a soft round brush here up at the top. And then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna start painting. Now, before I do anything, because this mask is black, we're going to be painting with white because we're going to be adding to this mask. And also, you'll notice up at the top here that I've set the flow to 8%. This is very deliberate. You don't want 100% flow, you want an eight to 10% flow, and they just wanna gradually brush on the highlights. So again, watch this. So we're at 8% flow, and now I'm gonna start here at the top, and if you look at the, if you look at the right side, right here, you're gonna see that I'm brushing in some highlights. So I'm just adding in some highlights. Basically, I'm adding back what we did earlier, but I'm leaving the rest darker. So I'm just adding in the little bits and pieces that uh, I think this pupperoo should have. And because we're working on the top copy, we're restricted to only the dog. So nothing outside of the dog is being highlighted. So here we go. So I'm just gonna go a little over the top, but whatever, I'll just show you the technique. And something like that. Now I'll turn it on and off. We've added in highlights. That is the entire process, step by step. Thanks for watching.